from the Gospel according to Luke. Jesus said to his disciples, The Son of Man must suffer greatly and be rejected by the elders, the chief priests, and the scribes, and be killed and on the third day be raised. Then he said to all, If anyone wishes to come after me, he must deny himself and take up his cross daily and follow me. For whoever wishes to save his life will lose it, but whoever loses his life for my sake will save it. What profit is there for one to gain the whole world yet lose or forfeit himself? Noi non possiamo pensare la vita cristiana fuori di questa strada. This is a synthesis of Christ's message and it is expressed very effectively in a paradox which shows us his way of speaking, almost lets us hear his voice. But what does it mean to lose one's life for the sake of Jesus? This can happen in two ways, explicitly by confessing the faith, or implicitly by defending the truth. Martyrs are the greatest example of losing one's life for Christ. In 2000 years, a vast host of men and women have sacrificed their lives to remain faithful to Jesus Christ and his gospel. And today, in many parts of the world, there are many, many, more than in the first centuries, so many martyrs, who give up their lives for Christ, who are brought to death because they do not deny Jesus Christ.